Hello and welcome to IWIN, the International Winners Information Network. I am Jennifer Salheen. I'm so excited to share this video with you today. Now let's take a look at Kiora, Q-U-O-R-A, Kiora.com. And over there, what we're going to do is we're going to learn a little bit about a social media platform where you can get all of your questions answered. And if you have the answers, then you can provide those for people that are asking questions. So here I am, and uh, here is my site, uh, my account on Kiora. And Kiora was created by two Facebook uh, geeks that um, designed this platform and say that any question that you have will be answered here on this site. All right, so uh, I went ahead. I've got one question and one answer. I've got two followers and I'm following 257. Right now, this is brand new. I just created this account just a, a few hours ago. And here is one of the questions that I posted. How do you promote your business for free so that you can build a list of prospects? So I got, um, we take a look at it there, and it says, uh, Miss Pinky, she responded and said, provide value, provide solutions to people's problem. It may be in the form of video tutorials, articles, infographic materials, ebooks, and free reports. Great. I went ahead and I followed her. Okay, so I went ahead and followed that person. So now they have three followers, and I gave her a post and upvote. Okay, great. Um, so now what you'll want to do is you'll, after you set up your account, you visit your feed. Okay, now here's my feed, and you follow 16 more topics. They want you to follow at least 20 topics. So I have 16 more topics to follow. We'll go ahead and do that now. And find your friends. All right. Like I said, I have about 100. Uh, I'm, I'm following some now. I need to upvote four more good answers. Ask your first question. Add info about what you know. And answer a question. So I'm going to go ahead and complete these two things. Follow 16 uh, more topics. And upvote four more uh, good answers. So uh, one second and I'll get that done. All right, we click on it, and it's going to bring up a list of topics that you want to follow. All right, um, let's see, we want to follow 14 more. It's just going to be just about everything here. Right, right. So let's start. Follow technology, science, books, business, um, travel, health. Ted, food, let's see, startups, psychology, economics, um, let's see, okay, Ted X, we'll find a couple more, startup, Mm-hmm. Current events, science of everyday life. We'll go there. Okay, we're just gonna find a couple more. Alright, that's looking pretty good. Do 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 and all right, let's take a look. Uh-huh. All right. Public speaking. We do that. Web development. Lean startup. So I'm sure we've got more than 14 now. Business strategy. Psychology. All right, we're going to do these things here. Because that's where we are basically. Alrighty, that looks good. Startup, business development, business models. 
Mm-hmm. Okay. And we're just going to finish up here. Angel Investors, Presentations. All right, this is all stuff that is relative to our brand. Okay, great. All right, we've got all these really great subjects. Mm, monetization. Okay, great. I don't want to take any more of your time. I didn't know that there's going to be so many more popping up. So we're going to go ahead and, and leave that. That's enough for now. Okay, we're going to um, upvote four more good answers. Let's see if we can find some good answers here. All right, so we're in the business strategy topic, and business strategy is an aspect of business planning that endeavors to align and structure resources in such a way as to obtain a competitive advantage in relation to perceived future events or evolving trends and the position of one's business in relation to others. So uh, we're here, and let's take a look for a great answer. What is the most underused strategy, idea, concept, or tool that could help businesses grow? There are five answers there. Let's take a look at the answers. We have an opportunity to write an answer here as well. The most underused tactic is that of actually talking to customers and non-stakeholders to see if they think a product has a compelling value proposition and truly making that feedback into the definition development process. Too often I see an approach to solving a problem that doesn't exist except uh, in the mind of the innovator. So we're going to give that an upvote. All right, we're giving it an upvote because we need to upvote three more good answers. All right, let's take a look here. You can leave a comment and say great answer. Great answer, Jim. All right, now let's go ahead. Somebody else said thanks, Jim. Agreed with too many. Uh, agreed that too many companies do not listen to what is needed. They make their own product, service, and hope the market will want it. I'm going to upvote that. That's another great. And um, that's fine. All right, so we have some, some other ones here, blah, blah. Probably like to do, um, let's see, people that have pictures and maybe they're more apt to build a relationship and follow me back. Here's Julia Janice. Um, don't know who she is, but... You know, people are kind of unanimous here. Valuing time of yourself and other people. Time is money. Get the people with experience and not a fancy degree. Um, we're going to pass on all that. Coaching to improve this condition, that's too much, too much. I'm not going to upvote that. All right, so let's find something else. What's the difference between Cura and Facebook? How about we take a look there? Okay. So that's the question, and here we have both platforms share the fundamental characteristics and features of online social networks. The key difference is that Facebook is designed to allow us to appear in the world the way we want to be seen, while Cura is designed to reflect the way we think. Okay. Let's see the comments on that. That's why Cura is so better. Besides reflect what I think, Cura actually helped me thinking. I found that answering coming on Cura helps myself to organize my thoughts. Sometimes you just can't do purely in mind. You have to speak out. That's my trick when I work. A, a Word document is a way for me to solve an issue, not a solution. With Cura, I got to use that trick with other parts of my life. So that's really awesome. Don't know why, but I've seen this kind of questions in almost all social networks I've used till date, but not Facebook. Everything is compared with Facebook. Okay, 
So anyway, um, this is kind of nice. We're going to up give that an upvote. And we're going to reply. So that's great. That's awesome. Reply. Okay, and let's find two more. Okay, now let's jump over to the happiness uh, topic and check here. Now, happiness is the state of mind or feeling characterized by contentment, love, satisfaction, joy, and accomplishment. I have followed that topic, and here's a question. Um, what is the one word that makes you feel happy? All right, there's 23 answers. How about that? And I also want the answer to it. So we're going to put that. I want answers. And we're finding the best person to answer this question, and we will notify you of new answers. So let's view um, this question. What is the one word that makes you happy? And um, you come down here. Calm. Now what you can do is you can go in here and you can follow these people. And um, just start building relationships here. Okay, one hour ago. Tells you about, um, they've got 10 views, 44 views. You're connecting with people that, um, you know, they're here and they're now. So find certain people that you want. And we need to upload one more good answer. We'll go ahead and do that. So how about, James, let's take a look and we'll uh, upload that. And we'll say... All right, so we're all done. We've we've set up our, our account. We've done all of these. We have them all completed. Now, let's go over here to my profile. All right, and uh, we've got uh, two questions out there, one answer. Uh, no post. We have three followers now, following 258 people, and there's been four edits. All right, so we're we've, we're getting it done. We are getting it done. So just wanted to show you that, uh, and you also here, you need 999 more answer views to unlock this section of your profile. So uh, write more answers. More answers are going to build your credibility because this uh, site here is to brand you um, in your business. So whatever it is that you do, you ask questions. Uh, what are you looking for? You're, you're, you're asking questions for people that are going to be your potential prospects. And you're giving answers uh, to people that are looking for information. You're setting up your credibility and uh, people are going to follow you, they're going to trust you, um, and they're going to buy from you. So what you do is, you know, you have your um, capture page and your autoresponder and everything set up so that when you are connecting and communicating with uh, people, uh, that you, if they do ask, what do you do, you are prepared to share your link appropriately. All right, so if you have any questions, connect with me, Jennifer Salhi. I'm over there on Facebook. Uh, you know, that's kind of where I hang out. Send me a message or, you know, definitely send me a message here on Curora so I can begin utilizing the space. All right, thanks so much for tuning in. Oh, and you may want to check out my video site. It's uh, www qcsocialmedia.com. That's qcsocialmedia.com.